Good day, guys. Hope you are all doing fine today. Today, I'm going to be showing us how to mock up our t shirts on a hanger like this. So, the first thing you want to do, okay, is to come to this site called smartmockups.com. Can you see? Smartmockups.com. Okay, I don't want to go off this page again. Okay, once you come to this site, you must have chosen the mock up you want. You see various templates here. Can you see? Let's go back. Let me show you. Once you come to Smart Mockup, head over to Apparel. This Apparel here. And you see Apparel. This one. We need to show you everything here. So you click on T shirt. Apparel, then T shirt. T shirt Mockup. That's what we want. Click on the T shirt. So there are free stock that we can use but they are pro version once you subscribe actually you can access this site without even signing up that's the sweet thing i like about it so can you see all this one that is showing pro pro they are paid you can use them or anyone that is showing collect collect it means you can use that one so now i want to collect the one that is on the hanger you scroll down all these ones and you see all these ones are free that are showing collect, collect. So you scroll down. Okay, so I want to use this one, this one that is on the hanger. Can you see? I've clicked one now. You allow it to load. Okay. Allow it to load. Make sure your internet is, is okay. So once it loads, it's going to show you the size. Can you see? So t-shirt size below 1,000 by 1,500 then the neck label that is 900 by 500. So we are heading to our design app called PCL Lab. Make sure your design is already on ground. So from PCL Lab here, yeah, we'll be able to resizing it so that it will fit in to that material properly. And you see, then I already have my design. I'm going to bring it in now. To make things easy for you have your design ready the only is just to resizing it so i'm going to be using this design this one and you see i'll just come here and increase it make sure it fits this size are we following guys and you place it in the center properly and you see okay now okay so you go to save make sure you lock it go to your layer and lock it so once you lock it you now go to save this up save as image then make sure it's on png and set it to be ultra can you see then you save after i save that we are looking for online staff can you see you check the neck label the neck label is 900 by 500 okay so you come back to pz lab once you come back to pz lab you go back to your background this is your layer this one here okay. can you see this blue icon below so now we go to image size this image size then i think it's 900 900 by 500 okay so it's 900 by just to move this one can you see so unlock it so that you'll be able to move it so now we reduce it follow what i do in the video reduce it then you increase it a bit you place it here then you drag can you see Place it in the center and you lock it again. So I'll be able to resize our uh, images. So you save. Do it the same way you did the first one. Ultra, then again in the second time now. So now we have to smart mockups now. The first of all, do for the t-shirt, click on upload, upload, to ask you to upload, then you upload image, click on upload image, 
then you should take it to your file then you search for what you just saved from your pixel lamp into your phone and no way mine is so this is the first one for the t-shirt click on it okay you allow it to load it's going to come up on the t-shirt after that you'll be able to customize it so it's still loading so it has come up it has come up let's do it from the top can you see how lovely it is let's let's do for the neck label the neck label that's behind behind the t-shirt at the top where the hanger is there so you click on upload you've already besides that design to so you upload image in pixel lab mm. same process make sure you know where all your designs or anything you want to use for your design work generally is kept okay so i want to bring that i want to use this one now this first one and you see smaller <laughs> so you allow it to look you see it's going to appear the color there just watch can you see it has appeared now I want to customize the t-shirt now. Click on customize t-shirt color. I want to change the color. Choose any color you like. Let me see. Let's leave it on that red. I think that red makes sense. That red makes sense to me. I like it. You can change it to white. You see the same thing. Click on the main color itself. I'll change it to brown. Let's go. I like that red. Let's be on that red. So that's all you can do from there now. Then you can click on image back. Can you see this download? Tap on it. Then that medium is where you are going to tap on because this two that has crown below. They are pro version. Okay. So this medium you tap on it. Don't worry, you can use it. Tap on it. Then it's going to get downloaded inside your phone. Okay, it's asking me to resize it. No, I don't want. It. Okay, so from here now, you just click on download. Make sure you use that medium because this one's a full version, like I said. Then you click on download to automatically download inside your, your device, your gallery. Then you can view it. Check your downloaded folder. You see it. I'm going to show you. So I like to load, okay? So this is how to mock up your, your t-shirt. Let's open it in the gallery. You can find it in your downloaded files. Can you see? Can you see how creative it is? So, nice one, guys. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If it's your first time watching my channel, my name is Reskilowas. Subscribe, like and share the video if it brings value to you. Okay.